Alexander Jefferson, Lieutenant Colonel, United States Air Force, retired. We're here at Benton Harbor to lest we forget. And as a representative of Tuskegee Airmen, I'm here to carry on the tradition and keep the legend going. We were the men who flew for the 332nd Fighter Group, escorting the B-17s and B-24s from Italy into Germany. Well, the 332nd is made up of four squadrons, the 99th, the 100th, the 301st, and the 302nd. 16 airplanes to a squadron with all of our enlisted men and the other compatriots. I had 18 and one half long range escorting mission, escorting the B-17s from Italy to Germany, Italy to Ploesti, Italy to Greece, Italy to France. Uh, my 19th mission was a strafing mission, strafing radar stations on the coast of southern France. I got blown away, I bailed out, and I spent nine months in Germany as POW. During the nine months, you didn't have anything else to do, to sit and draw pictures and read. International Red Cross was in, gave us paper, ink. I've often said the experience was almost mind-boggling, but I survived as an officer and a gentleman. The United States and Germ Germany, England, France signed the Geneva Convention, which controlled how you treat your officers who are in captivity. You put the officers in a camp and you do not make them work. You put the enlisted men in a separate camp. You can make them cut wood, work, and so forth and so on. I was treated as an officer and a gentleman, and no beatings, no torture, because literally they knew more about me than I knew about myself. They had all the information on my schooling. They even knew how much taxes my dad paid on his house. The German information was fantastic. I survived, came back to the States, and uh, went back to Detroit, became an elementary science school teacher. Spent my 22 years in the reserves, and I retired from the Detroit Board of Education in 1980. I retired from the United States Air Force as a lieutenant colonel in 1969. Life is good, life is better. I said once more, best country in the world. It's not perfect. We still got a lot of crazy people in it. But I tell young people, get involved become part of it, and help make it better. God bless America. Thank you.